Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Noelle and I do unboxings, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, travel, home decor, and even a dash of Disney. So if you enjoy unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And as always, if you are already subscribed, thank you so much for being here and welcome back. Today I have something a little bit different. It is a snack box. This is Taste Crate. Now Taste Crate is $39.99 per month. That does include free US shipping and each month they will send you 15 to 20 unique and hard to find snacks which sounds very intriguing to someone like me who does like to snack I often even after dinner find myself wanting a little something something so I'm hoping that this and the portions the sizes of the items in here make that a little bit easier and healthier for me now if you are interested in trying out taste crate you can save 25% on your first box using the code noel25 as always I'll leave all of that in information for you in the description box below. Now, I don't usually do taste tests on camera. I just think it's a little awkward to be opening packages and trying to make sure there's nothing in my teeth, but I will do some taste tests and show you some of the products over on Instagram. So if you're not already following me there, definitely follow me over there. So we're going to go check it out and see what we have got. I'm really excited. I didn't peek at all. So it says guilt-free snacks almost so that's what the interior of the box looks like doesn't look like there was any like kind of shred to make sure that nothing was getting jostled around and that is like one of my pet peeves as someone who likes to take photos of things is that sometimes the packaging gets all crinkled but you know packaging isn't everything even though with my lifestyle boxes I definitely think it's important so I'm just seeing a little like uh, you are awesome thank you and welcome to the taste crate family card but it doesn't look to me like there's an actual product card so we're gonna have to kind of read some labels and see what we have gotten here but this looks exciting you guys so the first thing I am seeing is from Skinny Lily and it's popped water lily seeds, but the flavor is sour cream and onion. Now this is a pretty package. Now I have had popped water lily seeds before. I think I actually got them in a Hermine box and they were delicious. I love like popped anything really. And I also really love sour cream and onion. So this does say that it is 130 calories per serving. Not bad, gluten-free, non-GMO, plant-based, also great. I don't have any personal dietary restrictions but you would definitely want to keep that in mind if you didn't want to subscribe now I'm very happy to tell you that this whole bag is just one serving size so 130 calories totally doable just the right amount instead of me making an entire bag of popcorn and then shoving that all into my face after I've already had dinner and it's always like nine o'clock that's always what I try to make myself do is like you cannot eat after 10 o'clock and I stay up pretty late these days but yeah when I eat like after nine o'clock at night it's like that's probably Probably not something you really really needed to go to sleep on um, these are amazing so this is a snack that I've gotten also in a subscription box I think these came in a vino box actually it's legally addictive the OG cookies made from crackers crackers it's toffee chocolate and sea salt you guys these are so good and the bag needs to be like five times bigger I'm glad that it's not but I would inhale it if it was so this <laughs> this is three servings in here which is kind of like a cracker uh, a cracker and a half I think so yeah servings per container 1.3 so you yeah, I think I, I'll like throw that extra 0.3 in there not too bad 150 calories so you're looking at like about 200 calories in this little package but these are so good Wow I wish they had put like five boxes five bags of those in there all right, now this is something I have never seen before. This is cosmic ice cream in strawberry. What is this? It's a freeze dried ice cream. So it's like, it's like astronaut ice cream, you guys. Do you remember getting that when you were a kid? Like when we were all obsessed with space? Was it just me? <laughs> And apparently Jeff Bezos. Um, so ice cream for adventure. This has 120 calories and it is just one serving size in here. You guys, I am so excited about space ice cream. So it makes sense that it's called Cosmic. So cool. Um, let's see what else. So far, I'm pretty happy. And honestly, like the packaging isn't too terribly damaged. So I spoke too soon. Pop Daddy pretzels. Ooh, cinnamon sugar pretzel sticks. This looks really good, you guys. I've had some cinnamon sugar pretzels sticks I love sweet and savory together it's gonna be awesome 140 calories per serving there are three servings in this container so maybe this is something I was gonna say I would share it with my husband but he doesn't like cinnamon so oh well guess it's all mine mmm gonna be so good 
says, at Pop Daddy, we are all about crave-worthy, crunchy snacks that pack a punch in the flavor department. We don't shy away from zesty, different, and downright tasty. So be it. Popcorn or pretzels, you can count on us for snacking experience that seriously satisfies. I kind of love this, that someone went out and like put all of this together so that you didn't have to go out on a limb and try like an entire bag of one of these snacks. Um, great marketing for them too. This is something that I've gotten in several subscription boxes as well by Split. It's peanut butter and jelly, but without the bread. So it's great for all of you who are trying to cut out the carbs. Um, so this is 170 calories. I think peanut butter by itself even, or almond butter is such a great like energizing snack. Um, I still haven't like figured out, I still think I would probably put this stuff like on a piece of bread because I love my like sourdough toast, but you could definitely just kind of eat it like yogurt, I guess. Um, I don't know that I would do that though. I know you can. I know it's kind of shaped like a flat bottle so you can just like squeeze it out, but let me know. Like, do you just like suck on these like and eat your peanut butter and jelly without the bread? It's not my thing. I like, I need a vehicle for it. Here is something that did get kind of <laughs> smashed in, in transit. That's okay. It's called Whoa Dough. <laughs> 170 calories. It is brownie batter, so it's probably not going to be the most photogenic item anyway, but I bet it tastes good. I really appreciate that they're doing some like savory, healthier snacks in here, as well as some more like indulgent, chocolatey deliciousness. So get ready. Whoa Dough is the amazing gluten free, plant based, non GMO, dairy free, egg free, soy free, no artificial flavoring, having protein delivering, happy inducing, craving crushing, health conscious cookie dough bar, and yes, they're vegan. Wow, that was a mouthful. Haha, ha, mouthful. Um, sounds like it's gonna be really good. So four grams of protein in there. It does say refrigerated or on the go. I'll probably refrigerate it. I kind of like that. Um, so that sounds good. We got, ooh, date and cashew bites in lemon coconut by Sun and Swell. Now these are like little energy balls. Like I know a lot of people like make these. A lot of my yoga teacher friends kind of like make these at home. Uh, this has 200 calories per serving because they are really like uh, nutrient dense, I believe. So not usually like my favorite thing. I don't know what it is about like date and cashew bites. Like sometimes it's just like the texture of them, even though I love dates as like a natural sweetener and I love cashews as just like a nut in general because they're like nice and fatty but it does I'll, I'll give these a try for sure I'll definitely give them a try but they're one of those like snacks that you're like oh these are supposed to be good for me too <laughs> all right so what else have we got some natural born snackers mavericks kids double trouble chocolate cookies they're like in the shape of a little like lightning bolt these are 110 calories for this one package that seems that seems good We've got some Diane's Kitchen Daily Crunch Cacao and Sea Salt Sprouted Almonds. Ooh, that sounds good. I do like me some almonds and then putting like some chocolate or cacao and sea salt on them probably makes them real good. Uh, 230 calories because they are nuts, so they have a little bit more fat in them. Uh, 20 grams of fat, so that's 28 of your daily allotted uh, value. And then it's one, one serving though in this package. I'm always pro that. Whenever it's one serving in the package, I'm okay with that. Now here is the the culprit this is what was smashing everything and then I think if this hadn't been in the box everything else would have been in a little bit of better shape this is an energy drink I think from Haywell uh, energy and immunity sparkling water with vitamins adaptogens and super herbs it does have 15 calories um, I think that's oh it's organic caffeine so not too bad I bet this is gonna be really good grapefruit love grapefruit um you could probably make this into an adult beverage but i think that's probably not the point to be getting your caffeine and then also you know spiking it but it might happen <laughs> so it's got some really good stuff in there too it's made to give you energy and support your immunity it says hey there we're hey well we believe wellness should be simpler and easier for everyone every day so it's got like so an immunity boost in there um, with gooseberry that's rich in natural vitamin C, some schisandra, an antioxidant superberry that I've never heard of, and L-theanine, an amino acid naturally found in green tea that sharpens your focus when paired with caffeine. I'll take it. And 75 milligrams of organic caffeine. And a really pretty packaging, which this, this didn't get dented, so good job on that. What else have we got? Vaca Dios carne seca, air dried beef. Ooh, do you like um, beef jerky? I do. Now, so I used to be a vegetarian. I could never be a vegan because I love my cheese, um, but I am no longer a vegetarian. Now I'm sort of an omnivore. Zero total sugar, 15 grams of protein per serving. The flavor is chili lime and check out that packaging. Very, very cool. This is something my husband will totally want to try too. It says, 
mucho sabor. Uh, so this is uh, two servings per container, so I'll have to share with him uh, 90 calories per serving, so not too bad. All right, let's see what else we've got. I'm trying to like keep everything organized so we can do a quick count afterwards. This is from Loom. Uh, glow granola for healthy hair and skin. Always love some granola. I like to put that on my yogurt or sometimes my husband steals it from me and puts it on his yogurt because he eats yogurt every morning. Uh, 190 calories. Uh, really like I really appreciate the like sort of trendy, um, witty, whimsical uh, text and copy that's on a lot of these like newer brands. I think it's it's very charming. We got something from Y Bars, Zesty Lemon. It's a superfood snack bar. It has, ooh, 282 calories. 119 of them are fat calories. So this is like a very like energy dense, like you need that like boost. So this would be like good for before or after you go on like a hike. Um, it is heavy too, I can tell you. It feels kind of heavy. I really like lemony things. So this might be something like, like I said, I might take it before going for a hike or like a kind of high energy day where I don't really want to eat like and have my stomach feel Full, but I do want to feel like I have some energy. This is a really honestly nice very variety of snacks. I gotta say I'm pretty impressed. I'm pretty impressed. Tastes great. Mezcla. I, thought, <laughs> I was like, hmm. Plant protein bar. It's vegan, non-GMO, and gluten-free. It's Peruvian cocoa peanut butter with amaranth and quinoa. 10 grams of plant protein. It's 170 calories total. I don't know what to expect expect from that but cocoa peanut butter I mean I like chocolate and peanut butter so sounds good to me man I've got a lot of snacking to do which I'm super into and I also love that the stuff that I'm like kind of iffy on I can like hand it over to my husband and let him try it or even like send it into his workplace and have them try it okay we have one more thing you guys this is something I'm passing on because this is not my favorite nut Crazy Go Nuts, the superfood snack, the delicious superfood snack. It's um, banana flavored, all natural gourmet walnuts. I, I don't know if it's like a genetic thing. You know how some people are predisposed to not like broccoli or what, uh, other vegetables. Like for whatever it is, like walnuts always taste slightly bitter to me. So I usually try to avoid them when there's like baked goods or anything with walnuts. I'm like, nope, not my thing. Um, I know some people love their walnuts. They're like a great healthy snack, but like they're just not, they're not my thing so let's see there are 180 calories in this container and it does say that this is one serving size so a nice little go to go snack for someone so let's just count up what we got I have five things here still in the box six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen like I said they do promise fifteen to twenty and that is exactly what we got I can tell you right now that I'm super excited about these because I've had them before I'm also real excited about the cinnamon pretzel because I think those will be awesome. Sour cream and, any, and onion, anything crunchy, salty, deliciousness, those water lilies seeds will be awesome. I'm also, I'm, ooh, the like cosmic ice cream, very excited about that. The stuff I'm a little trepidatious about is like the little um, cashew and date balls, you know, the walnuts, anything that like looks too healthy. I'm pretty excited about the freeze dried beef too, or what is it? Is it freeze dried? Air dried air dried beef that sounds pretty good to me too let me know which of the items or several maybe you had a couple favorites in there that looked good in this box to you in the comments below or if you've tried any of them especially the ones that i'm like i don't know how to eat this uh definitely let me know that as well and give this video a thumbs up it was something a little bit different like i said i just don't want to be rude and eat on camera but i will give these things a try and try to report back to you so feel free to ask questions see if it's something i've given a shot uh, since i taped this video i hope you did enjoy it and i hope to see you all very very soon in my next unboxing